my channel and if you're new welcome to my channel okay let me welcome you all as i just did um make sure you go shop the beauty box dot net and that's beauty what an i not a y so i wanted to talk to you guys about protecting your lashes what glues to use what glues not to use and how to reuse your lashes after maybe one or two wears so let's get into this video so you know if you wear strip lashes or if you order lashes from me they're going to be strip lashes because they're strictly high quality mink 3d lashes or 25 millimeter lashes so you will need lash glue so the glue that i personally use for my lashes is strip lash glue clear it says clear but it comes out white it's clear once it dries so i'm going to show you that glue right now it is this glue and i buy it from the beauty supply i believe it's like two dollars so i'm not really sure but it is strip lash glue this lash glue does not burn your eyes um it can be messy um if you like make a mistake but it's easy once you put the lash on if you mess up it's easy to maneuver the lash and get it where you need it to be so i highly recommend this lash glue for strip eyelashes and we all know that we all used to use or maybe we all still use hair glue for our lashes these are hair glues so this hair glue 30 seconds comes in a big bottle like this and a small bottle all the reason i had a bottle is because i bought it for a quick weave and now it's just sitting around but um 30 seconds people prefer the 30 second they'll hair glue over this hair glue because 30 second dry faster and this hair glue it comes in a bigger bottle as well but i didn't get the bigger bottle so i got the small bottle i believe this bottle is 249 and this one is 449 so 30 seconds dry faster than the regular one but we know with hair glue it does sting your eyes if you get some hair glue in your eye or maybe in like the little corner of your eye anywhere near your eye is gonna burn your eye is gonna sting so i'm not saying that i wouldn't recommend this glue because sometimes when you do use hair glue it lasts longer but with using hair glue excuse me with using hair glue it does strip your natural lash and you do not want to take your lashes off and you be bald head underneath. I am not bald head really. I have lashes. But from me using hair glue, my lashes have been stripped. But with me using this lash strip glue clear, um, it has been protecting my lashes because once I take it off, it's not like a hard rip as of when you use hair glue. When you use hair glue, it's it's really, so when you take that strip off, it's ripping your natural lash off, the dead natural lash. Any natural lash is ripping it off with the fat false lash. Why it does that, I don't know. But be careful, really careful if you use hair glue. I wouldn't really make recommend it but it does really last longer. This lash glue lasts long as well. I just recently had my lashes on for five days, I believe. And that's a long time, that's almost a week. And um, some people take their strips off when they go to bed and put them back on in the morning. Honestly, me, I don't because I don't have time for that. I have to be up at six something, sometimes five something in the morning just to go to work so i don't have time to put my lashes back on in the morning because my nails are long as well so it takes me a couple minutes to put my lashes on that's talking about applying the lash so um some people use their bare hands like that 
but like I said, um, my nails are really long, so it's somewhat hard for me to grip the lash. So sometimes I use tweezers, just regular tweezers, so I won't poke myself in the eye. But this is how I do put my lashes on. I will um, demonstrate. I'm not going to put any meat on right now, but I will like visualize it for you guys. So when I'm doing this lash, I put the lash glue on and then I put it on and then I go back with the bottom of the tweezers and I do like that to the ends to make sure they're on all the way. And with this eye, it's really hard for me to see. It would be really messed up if I do it with my hands. So... I put it, I grab the back of the lash and I put it on there and then I hold it, this part down like that and then I put it on there and then I push it up, make sure they're on like that and then I use my lash curlers and I curl them. If you want lash curlers, um, you can get them on my site for $3.99 or if you buy two pair or more lashes, you get a free lash curler. So make sure you go shop with me and orders $50 or more. You get 25% off with the cold flower. So yes, make sure you go shop with me. And I just really want everybody that's wearing false eyelashes, individuals or strips to protect your lashes. And I also want to tell you guys about this lash glue. It's called IMB and it's for um, individual lashes and it's clear. I tried to use that on my strip lashes and it did not work. It will not stick at all. But I'm like, if it could stick individual lashes on, it should be able to stick a strip on, right? No, it did not work. And I was really upset because that lash glue was $4 and it was only this big. So yeah, don't try IMV clear glue for um, individual lashes. Do not try those on strips. <laughs> So, yeah, guys, make sure you shop the beautybox.net and it's beauty with an I, not a Y. And I have everything you need lip gloss, lashes, body oils, hand sanitizer. Make sure you get your hand sanitizer. If you're not staying home, make sure you're staying safe always. And all other beauty care needs that you guys may need. So please make sure you check out my website. I also have a blogging um, section on my website. So make sure if you need some extra motivation or anything, make sure you check out my website, the blogging section. So we all can connect and make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Follow my Instagram at thebeautybox underscore. So we want underscore and it's the beauty box with an I, not a Y. Thanks guys for watching. Also, P.S. I must add that I'm wearing you glitz me lip gloss from my own products, the beauty box. I wanted to show you guys that gloss. Make sure you shop. Love you guys. See you next time.